It's Thursday, April 23rd, 2015. From Studio E at Michigan State University, it's the Beaumont Bulletin. Good evening, I'm Katie Phillipson. And I guess that makes me Brian Brown. Here's what's making news this week. Hillary Clinton announced her candidacy for President of the United States. And if you're looking for a punchline, Ted Cruz declared his candidacy as well. Police are investigating a theft from a Minnesota farm where $70,000 worth of bull semen was stolen recently. Ah, come on. Thank you, Brian. Tim Tebow signed with the Philadelphia Eagles on Sunday. He immediately thanked God for blessing him with the ability to keep the bench nice and toasty for the real football players. Netflix has announced a spinoff from 90s sitcom Full House coming in 2016. The show will be produced by John Stamos and his crack team of flavored yogurts. Last Saturday, Michigan State University Telecasters hosted the fourth annual Albie Awards. I took home the award for best host while Brian took home, oh, nothing. Like Adam Sandler at the box office. Hey. Like Ted Nugent at PETA's Humanitarian Awards. Well, that's just... Like the U of M football team on Saturday in the fall. Are you done yet? Making one-liners? Yes. Bringing home hardware? That's my job. Also at the Albies, the award for most improved show went to the... Son of a bitch. I don't think that's a show on Telecasters. <laughs> Brian? <laughs> Brian, we're on air. Brian? The draft house. It's really not that big of a deal. The Bolton also won the Albies for best sound and best screenplay. So suck it, drafts. It's all right, they're an endangered species. Over the past two weekends, the Coachella Music Festival kicked off in Coachella Valley, California. The popular music festival featured a variety of different genres and musical acts, including the small, obscure groups you've never heard of for obvious reasons. The festival is famous for the number of relatively obscure groups featured in its lineup. This year included groups such as Axwell and Grosio, Chicano Batman, Dynasty Crunch, Subtract, Autonomous Healer, Hearts, and Panda Bear. And if those groups sound unfamiliar, they should. We've taken the liberty of making up some group names to highlight how ridiculous they sound. We'll let you figure out which ones are real on your own. Among the big name acts were Kygo, Alabama Shakes, David Guetta, Flo Stradamus, Jack White, and Tyler the Creator. However, the biggest uh, name to make news was Madonna, who performed a song and made out with artist Drake on stage. Drake described it as the most awkward romantic experience he's had since his lap dance from Nicki Minaj. Madonna wasn't the only one to make news at Coachella. After arriving backstage at Drake's performance, Justin Bieber was informed that they were at capacity. Bieber continued arguing and eventually the situation escalated until he was removed by security in a chokehold. Bieber was choked harder than Drake was by Madonna's ancient harpy tongue. Damn, that's rough. Eh, it's all how vampires feed. Well, it looks like that'll do from us at the Bulletin. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter, at Bo Bulletin, to stay up to date on the most important news. Also, before we go, here's a sneak peek of the next season of the Beaumont Bulletin. Next season on the Beaumont Bulletin. In other news, Brian just spent 40 minutes on his makeup today because he was jealous that he did not get nominated for Male Crush. Contouring. Really big jaw. So but it's listen. like throwing a hot dog down a hallway, but the hallway's like really wide. But the thing is, Action. they should. Is Brock? He's gone, Anna. You need to accept it already. What are you three even doing? We have no idea. We're in Madison. My major doesn't even cover this. Yes. Uh, and that is uh, on my next album called. That's on my next album. His drama. And sources say the dog can. Sources say the dog can ride the bus. God damn it. So cute! Put a little, put a little hat on it. Put a little hat up, put it on your lawn. It's like, oh, that's. A recent report has Katie's cockiness skyrocketing after her one LB win. I mean, look 20. at us. I'm claiming realness, realness, realness. Kind of slimmed down that nose, huh? Keeps getting in frame? Yeah. Love. Love? Love? No. I think you need to like take a break. <laughs>